Bubble notes are a special type of notes in Kurzweil 3000. Like bookmarks or text, sticky, and voice notes, Bubble notes allow you to anchor a note in the document where you want to recall important information or where you want to add your thoughts and ideas. However, there are two unique aspects about Bubble notes. You can set them up to help you learn vocabulary, and you can create quizzes to help you study and test yourself when, on what you've learned. We'll show you how to do both. To create a bubble note, have a document open, click near or on a word where you want the note to open. Go to the Tools menu, Note, and Add Bubble Note. The Bubble Notes dialog opens. If you want to use this as a regular note, simply make your entry in the main text area. Then click OK. Once you've created a bubble note, a question mark appears in the document where you place the note. When you read through the document, Cursor 3000 opens and reads Time the bubble travel note. By Margaret Let's McElway. click Read. This is a note. Click OK to close the note. Will it really be possible to visit the future? If you want to use the bubble note for vocabulary learning, here are the steps. Place the note. We'll click here in Kids. Get Add Bubble Note from the Tools Note menu. And in the dialog, type the word into the keyword area. Then enter the definition in the main text area. Next, let's select some options. We can change the appearance of the note from balloon to cloud. For open options, let's have this note open when the word is read. To have Crossroad 3000 spell the word when we read this document, in the reading options, select Spell Keyword. Click OK. Now let's go back into the document and read. Have robots taken over? Kids. K. I. D. S. Kids. Baby goats. And we'll Kids close chores? out of this Take a trip to 2025. Now we'll create a quiz bubble note. Recall that to create a bubble note, you click near or on a word where you want the note to open. Then go to Tools, Note Menu, and choose Add Bubble Note. Now let's enter the question in the main text area here. Next, consider the following options when creating a quiz question. For open options, use the default open after a unit is read. For reading options, use the default read note on open. For question options, you have a lot of choices. You can do text answer, true or false, and multiple choice. Let's go with multiple choice. You can do radio buttons, which are these little round boxes that you can click. 
You can do check boxes that give you boxes that you can also click. Or you can do match that allow you to match from the left column to the right column. Let's go with check boxes and then we can decide how many we want. We'll use the down arrow to select how many. And then type in the entries. And click OK. Now let's go back in and read and open the bubble note. Newest virtual reality games. Select the correct answers. This article is about future, best friends, time travel. And we'll go ahead and select the answers. And click OK to close the Time and note. speed time travel isn't something only for the future. And that's really all there is. If you are a teacher, Bubble Notes can be a useful aid in monitoring students' comprehension and helping them stay on task.